guys are working behind me. This job, I think I've already mentioned this once or twice or three times, but we're on a 11,000, between 11,000 and 12,000 foot project. We're putting three inch and a quarters in, three inch and a quarters conduit. See this is the plow. And uh, most of it we've actually plowed in. Some of it we're drilling, but most of it we plowed. Today we're drilling. We have to drill across three major gas lines today. And uh, the guys are sucking out the potholes right now. We do have a watch and protect that's gonna show up, but he told me to go ahead and suck the potholes out. And then he would show up for when we uh, pour across them. But uh, we gotta connect. We gotta connect where our box is gonna be set to across. We gotta go across the uh, gas lines. Here in the near future, we're gonna go across 470, which is just right over there. We gotta bore across that as well. We can't come across 470, it's too major. You'd tear everything up. But anyway, we're going to do a little bit of drilling today. Let's do it. Number one gas line, 24 inch. Number two gas line, 22 inch. Number three gas line, 24 inch. We are crossing these, one, two, three. I'm just double checking measurements here really quick because it's good to double check, you know. And this one is supposedly 80. We're gonna cross these at three foot, so it's not huge. It's not a huge deal, but let's see. It's like 77 inches. A little off, 77 inches. Mark this real quick. And then uh, we gotta steer it a little bit. That's one foot 11 or two foot. Dane, stop dropping rods, brother. Uh, Dane, I need you to carve uh, 10 and 11. See, he's gonna carve 10 and 11 right here. All right, we're pushing 10 and 11 now. Then drill a little bit and drill. Okay, you can see the head right here. See that pipe? That's our drill head. We're at two foot eleven. First gas line crossed. Now we gotta do two more. Hang on, I gotta steer you a little bit. Uh, go ahead and push three. Push three. Drill a little bit, drill. Right. He's changing rods now. See what it looks like after pushing. Two foot 11. There we go. Go ahead and drill half a rod, Dane. Drill half a rod. 
we'll have him drill and then check it and then uh, adjust if we need to. Okay, go ahead and drill slowly. Hang on, stop. There it is right there. And the actual depth is two foot 11. Go ahead and drill a little bit, Dane. This is number two. One more gas line right there. Two foot nine right there. This was two foot eleven. Right in the hole. There's Dane working away. There's a little bit of three. There's a little three. Drill, drill, buddy. Drill, drill. Headed for that hole right there. All right, this is the third and final gas line we're crossing. And I don't know if you can see it, but that's uh, damn good. And let me see here. Now we got to drill that way. All right, Dan, go ahead and drill a little bit. You can hear it. Here we go. Success so far. All right, we're crossing this. See that cone over there? There's a box that we gotta go into that they set already. There's a little bit of nine, nine. Drill, drill. Alright Dane, push 11, 11. Drill slowly, drill. Okay, hold on, a little more, drill a little more. Okay, uh, stop right there, hold on. Whoa. Ready. We're good. We're good. You can open. You can. Uh, it's in the box. It's right there. See. Make sure your water's off. Make sure your water's off. This is right there, buddy. There it is. He found it. Hey, Dane. Can you slow? Uh, you can rotate it and then pull it back like six inches. Rotate it fast and. Pull it back a little more, a little more, a little more, a little more. Okay, stop. What we gotta do is uncover the drill head and hook our swivel on with our pipe. Pull it all the way back to Dane, which is about 220 feet. Okay, hold the stop. Uh, keep rotating. A little more right there, that's good. Oh, put your fingers in the hole, Carlos, you'll lose it. Okay, Chan, we gotta hook that up. Hey, Dane, can you turn off the uh, receiver for the locator so that we have battery? You need help? Are you good? You need a wrench? He's gonna need it probably. There it is, it's hooked on. We're just gonna tighten her down. Pull straight back. We install these conduits and then later on, either we come back and install fiber pull or blow fiber through them or somebody else will. That's what they're for anyway. That's probably good, eh? Yeah. Good. Make sure it's straight. All right, Dane, turn your water on. It's on, go ahead and pull straight back. Do not spin it, pull straight back. Bye -bye.
All right, we have one, two, three pipes going in the ground, and the drill's way over there. You're good to spin it back, Dan. Go ahead and spin it back. Perfectamente. Here we go. This is the board path, these white dots. This is where we were drilling, as you can see. Then we'll be able to see maybe our drill stem in this hole. Okay. I'm gonna try and get the pipe coming through, the actual conduit, but it may fill up with water. It's pulling back pretty quick. It may fill up with water too, I don't know. Oh, it's already full of water. I'm not gonna be able to see the pipe going through, the conduit going through behind the head. That one also has water in it. So does this one. All right, that's all right. We'll see it come out this, this end here. I'll show you. We got her back. Look at that. Very muddy. All right, we just gotta get the uh, conduit out of the ground. And, uh, clean up a little bit here. That's, that's, has clay in it, that's for sure. Clean off the water, fill the pump. I'm gonna pull this truck forward so he can back up a little. Good day. The boys are wrapping up over here, cutting off the conduit in the box, rolling it back up onto the trailers. There we go. Easy day, huh? We're set up again for the second time today. We gotta shoot across this driveway to the entrance of the dump. About 330 some feet. We have 366 feet of pipe, so it's perfect. Let's go. All right, push six. Push five, actually. Here we go, everybody. We're in the ground. Gonna mark this. Go ahead and drill, drill. These conduits were plowed in. Now we're drilling past them to connect those ones that we plowed in and the ones we plowed in over there. Six foot right there. Yeah, drill, drill. We're crossing the driveway to this huge landfill. This is a big old landfill. I don't know if you noticed that. Watch out for these semis. <laughs> See what I mean? They're huge. Huge trucks. Yeah. Build, build in. We're gonna keep working here. Drill, drill, it can fall back down, that's fine. Drill, drill. We made it past the driveway, now we just gotta go under that cone over there, that one, there, onto our conduit. We're about to pop out of the ground, everyone. Uh. 
Hey, uh, Dane, you can uh, go ahead and push one. Drill, drill. Here it comes, Carlos. Baby. Come on, Dane. Let's go, let's go. <laughs> exactly. Here it comes. See the ground moving? You might have to do one more rod, I don't know. It's right here. Hey Dan, that's perfection. Put it at 12. Turn your water off. Alright, we gotta hook up real quick. Let me pull forward so it comes off the reel alright. Carlos got us all hooked up here. Hey Dan, we're all hooked up. Go ahead and turn your water back on and pull straight back. No spinning. There's the water, boys. Oh, Dan must be hungry. Dan must be ready for dinner. You think Dan's ready for dinner? He's doing it really fast. <laughs> Go ahead and spin it back, Dan. <laughs> Dan's hungry. Yeah, I think hungry. It's ready to go home. Yeah, it's very fast. <laughs> <laughs> There's a drill way over there. There's our reels of pipe. We just gotta get it all the way back there and then we can be done for the day. Here it comes. We sort of took a risk on this one because I think that there it's clay under there. And Dane ran out of water in his main tank, so we ended up using water on the back. We ran out of that one, and so we used water, just plain water out of the back. And uh, it didn't have any mix in it. And that's a risky business, because if there's clay, it'll squeeze down on the conduit, and uh, you'll eventually break it off. But that did not happen today, because we did have some mix from that tank in the hole. So. You gotta get cleaned up. Yeah, you guys can go ahead and uh, cut them off, tape them, and we can get ready to go. Unhooked, loaded, and uh, vamanos a la casa.